So it's Saturday morning, it's seven o'clock, and we thought we'd show you what an average weekend's like for us here now we're living in Australia. Excuse the look, the hair's like straw, ropey old pyjamas on, but this is how we roll. So it's 7 a.m., I'm the only one up at the moment. Just about to take Samuel his breakfast, but I think he's the only other one awake. And then I'm heading for a gym session at eight o'clock. Okay. okay, so all ready for the gym now. Georgia's just woke up, so I'm just going to take her, her breakfast up before I head off to the gym. And then hopefully by the time I get back, Rich will be up. I'm just showing my beautiful Valentine's flowers. Mummy's going to the gym, okay? So you want to get back? Okay, so just got to the gym. Try and do three sessions a week if I can. You think I look rough now? Just wait. Just you wait till I've been in there an hour. That's it. That's my session done for this morning. I did warn you. I did warn you it was going to get worse. So Richard's just sent me a text message to say, are you at the gym or are you downstairs? So I'm guessing he's only just woke up. So I'm now gonna go and grab us a coffee from the coffee shop and then see what we're gonna do for the day. Hello. Rich? Hey, right. in, in the pool. That's all right for some, isn't it? Waiting for his coffee. All right. Hello. Are you a coffee? Thank you. Not long been up then. I've been up plenty of time, thank you. Mm. You didn't even know if I was here or not? Yes, I did. So we've decided to have a couple of hours around the pool this morning. Then we're going to have an early lunch and then we're going to head off down to the Gold Coast, I think. Is that the plan, Rich? I reckon, yep. We'll go down to Burley Heads. Yeah, try a bit of a different beach today. Hope the sun stays out for us. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do a bit later on. We'll take you with us. George is cooling off. Right, mate? Yep. Okay, Samuel. Mm -hmm. What are you eating there? Coffee beans. Coffee beans, mum made, coated in chocolate. Oh. Homemade coffee beans. Just right for 10 o'clock in the morning, isn't they, mate? Georgia, Georgia. Oh my god, brilliant. <laughs> Can she make it two in a row? Oh, get in. She likes it under pressure, don't she, Samuel, when the camera's on her? Oh, get in. Come on, Georgia. Oh, she failed. Samuel, you turn now. Okay. I bet I'll lose over there. I can George gets. Balls, yeah. you know, I One. Yay! Oh, he's got the angle now. Come on, come on, make it a tie with Georgia. 
four in a row. Mom, oh, Mom, okay. stop. Oh, I knew that'd be my it's a slight change of plan. We looked at the map for the Gold Coast and the traffic looked a bit heavy. So where are we going, Rich, instead? We're going to Manly and Wynnum. So we will show you what it's like when we get there. I've never been before, so it'd be nice to try somewhere different. Okay, so we just pulled up and Mum's just papped her pants, haven't I you? I didn't pap my <laughs> pants, I just went, oh my god. Didn't she, guys? Yes. Yeah. Stop she lying, did. Mum. What? Why did she? Whatever. Because they're spiders. There's some big old spiders. Let's go and have a little look, shall I ain't we? never seen a bunch like that before. They're huge. Right. So let's give you a perspective. There's a car. And the spiders. Oh yeah. Okay, so I've just got back from the chemist warehouse where the lady behind the counter said to me, have you ever been told that you look like no. Mark Zuckerberg? Mm, no, no, I haven't no. been told that. I've had Peter Crouch <laughs> before. I've had Matthew Letizia, Jamie Vardy, but that's a new one. You do look so like Jamie Vardy though. Do I? Yeah, a bit. What, when I'm playing football? Yeah. Yeah, thanks mate. <laughs> just dive in there. Mm. Can you though? That's the thing. Yeah, I can. There's another one there. Okay guys, so here we are at Wynnum Wading Pool. Down here, my love. Very nice. Think. You're quiet today. Makes a change in front of the camera. Some of us weren't still laying in bed at half past eight. Ouch! Ouchie. Boysenberry. Just arrived at Manly at the marina. Did someone yeah, say Manly? Okay, <laughs> this is called Manly Boathouse. Then I'll have a look. It's 
So guys, we've just had some food at the Manly Boathouse. Haven't we, Sam? Yeah. Yep. I had what did you uh, have? chips and chicken. <laughs> nice. So I just wanted to pan around and show you the view from our where we're eating. It's very nice. The Pièce de Journée Golden Girls Hello girls Just having a, a little dream of what we're going to buy when the kids move out and we retire Which one have you got your right on Rich? Um, probably this one on the left that has got one of their nets that you can sit in while you ploughing through the ocean. Right, yeah. Okay, yeah. That could be for the There's hundreds, isn't there? Weekend. I know which one I have one. It's recording. Tell the people what the deal is. There's, 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 so a, so there's a skink in the bathroom, so we're gonna try and get it. Oh, it's apparently white. It's in the bathroom. <laughs> Dad's getting that. You are never going to catch him in that. Oh what my god. Brilliant, brilliant. Dad's going to get it. Where is he? Under the sink. Under the sink. Under the sink. He's a skin. He's camouflaged. Get in there, Samuel. Yeah. What's your dad in action? Hello. <laughs> oh, you can't kill him. Look at him. Get in there. Hello. Oh, he's just <laughs> ran into the glass. Under. Into. Got the pot on. Easy, Look, Samuel, there's the skink. Oh, he's quick. He wants to get out. Take him downstairs, put him outside. Come on. Ready? Mm -hmm. There he goes. <laughs> Skink. Mr. Skink. So that was a bit of an excitement for a Sunday morning. A bit of skink catching. So yeah, the kids and they freak out a little bit when they see the skinks, but they're good for the houses out here if they get in because they eat the insects and spiders and stuff. So they actually look after us, so let's try and look after the old skinkies. That's what I say. Apparently there's another skink. So we're gonna get this one, he's a baby. Right, we'll go again. Let's find baby little skink. So he's down here, look. Let's see if we can get him. I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to do this without them getting underneath. The door. Come on, mate. I'm wasted in my yeah, job, aren't I? Don't I? Know you do it. That looks really 
Better release it where we did the other one just oh, in case. Yeah, it's I'll be, oh, yeah, yeah. He'll be standing out there waiting for yeah. his child. Could you come over the pop? front door, please? I don't know where he's gone to release it. Oh, here he comes. Job done. Job done. Well it did done. look a little bit like the other one. So, typical weekend for us. Yeah, we've been out and about, done some stuff, chilling by the pool. Sam was having a little uh, little go on Mummy's, what would you call this thing, would you say? Sinking chair. Sinking chair, all oh, right, yeah. Gonna show us how it, how it works? Okay. That's where you sit on that. Like this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Want a pina colada? So it my bum on there, Samuel. I'm actually sinking. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you get that hat wet? Oh no, that's not good. I think we need to get down the bottom of the pool, to get all the little bits out, don't we? Yeah. You going in? See you. See you. So Georgia and Mum have gone to the shops just to get a few little foodie bits for lunch. Get me some crackers to have with my cheese. Couldn't believe it, bought some really nice cheese yesterday. Got back in the car on the way home, said to mum, looking forward to having that with some, uh, that cheese with some nice crackers. She said, you'll have a job. We ain't got no crackers. One job she has. One job. She couldn't even get me crackers. So I've reprimanded her. Hold on. I've reprimanded her. And she's going to get me some crackers today. So after some lunch, we're going to head out on the bikes. So we've not had our bikes for four months. So it's nice to have a bit more freedom other than just the car. Because bikes get you so many different places and see things off the beaten track that you don't see in the car. So yeah, looking forward to getting out on the bikes. <laughs> Good one. So tell me about your swimming lessons that you're having at the moment at school. Every Friday. Every Friday, where? Our school pool. In the school pool, is it indoor or outdoor? Outdoor. Outdoor, is it warm? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. And what's the teachers like? Nice. Nice? What have they been teaching you? A rocket push-off. Rocket push-off? Well, are you going to show us a rocket yeah. push-off? So we're all getting ready to go for a little bike ride. The kids are over the moon about this, so I cannot tell you. Excuse the hair, only I've got to have a helmet on. So, um, getting all kitted out, Samuel? No. No? Yeah. All ready? Looking Smiles. forward to it? Oh. Georgia, let's have a look at your happy little face. Come on. Oh, they love it. They love being taken out. So Can you do it? Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Well, that went smoother than I thought, Mummy's turn. Can you put yours on, Mum? Yeah. Need to do? It's fine, thank you. Okay, come on then. Put your helmet on. That's it. I know what you're thinking. What? There aren't many people could carry off this look like what I do. Um, but you know, it's just one of them things. Here we are going. So after a bit of initial hoo-ha with the bikes, I think uh, the kids are a little bit rusty. Not used to it for four or five months having not been on the bike. But you never forget to ride a bike as they say. So yeah, we're now up and running. I want a nice little bike route. George is back here. So I'm going to go up ahead.
So these are the fields right here where the touch rugby takes place during the week. Football, soccer, as they say here sometimes, goes on here. That's what I play as well. So this little path leads up to Georgia's secondary school. Your high school, Georgia, up here. So they have jotted around these little waterways for the excess water runoff, I think. So when you have storms and stuff out here, instead of it flooding the drain system, they have these uh, waterways, which I dare say last year might have been pretty full because they had uh, quite a lot of flooding in and around Brisbane. Uh, believe it or not, the pitches are actually quite nice here. Nice and green at the moment, but I have been told that they do uh, they do get a little bit worse in the winter. Funnily enough, I'll take a bit of a pounding because of the amount of sports that goes on. There's the Redlands United Football Club, where I play, and Samuel plays. This is actually the pitch here, just here that I play on on a Friday night matches. And that there where you see the Paul Bancroft Centre, that is where Georgia's high school is, Cleveland District State High School. Hang on guys, sign off for now. Cheerio. So, we have just got back from our little bike ride. It was quite warm actually. 30 degrees, nice breeze though, but it gets you a little bit sweaty. What do you reckon to the bike ride gang? Yeah, it was good, weren't it? It was. Perhaps should go out on our own next time. Why? I like a little bit of speed and adventure, and the kids weren't really up for it, were they? I was speedy. No. You got the hang of it in the end, Samuel, didn't you? You, you didn't want to do it at first. But you glad you did? Zooper duper. You weren't your zooper duper, didn't you, today? <laughs> I only made one coat. Made me a nice iced coat. Yeah, it's quite warmer than I thought it was going to be today. Yeah. It's funny because. I've had people back in the UK say to me, oh, that must get a bit much every day. Oh, it really don't, does it, Rich? No. To wake up to sunshine every day is just, especially when you do get down some days, it's nothing like waking up to sunshine. So I'm sorry, it don't get too much. And waking up next to me. Helps, I Yeah, hope. I mean, the sunshine, you just can't beat waking up to that every day. No, what about your husband? Yeah. I don't <laughs> don't really see you with your eyes open there next to me, do I? I'm up a good hour before you. <laughs> that is true. But in the evenings, though, you're fast asleep when I'm still busy. Yes. Whatever. Whatever. Oh, yes. G'day, peeps. Me again. So, our Sunday... Um, it's almost coming to an end. Well, we're about 25 past four. So, just check in with the gang, let you know what they're up to on our typical clues weekend. So, Samuel and their mum are chilling out to their favourite NAF 80s Sunday Arvo chill out sesh. What are we watching today then? BMX Bandits. BMX Bandits. 1983. That's sick with Nicole Kidman in. Lovely. What are you at in Samuel? Any good? Oh, doesn't, don't sound too convinced. Yeah, it's good. Oh, good. Let's see what the little lady's up to. Little lady. 
，晚安，谢。George is busy. Are you up to this? Let me show the people at home your drawings. Not this one. Okay, let's have a little look. Perfume. Oh, yes. This little perfume. This. That's excellent, darling. Well done, you. Give yourself a little pat on the back. I'll do it for you. There we go, gang. See you later. So there you go, gang. That was our typical weekend here in Oz. Hope you've enjoyed watching and you are enjoying watching the videos we're posting. We're trying to think of some interesting content for you to keep it a bit different rather than just show you all the frills and spills. So um, yeah, hit us up and let us know if there's anything in particular you want to see here or we don't. That'd be good. Take care, peeps. Bye-bye.